God is saying, some people don't come into your life to add value. Instead, they come into your life to harm you, to drain you, and to take from you. They will never add value to your life, so treat them like a spam email. God is so good, and this word is so timely because just this week, I was checking up on an old email account, and I realized I had received an email from somebody who I had blocked. Now, when I saw the email, I'm like, I'm not even going to open up this email. I'm just going to block and delete because I'm at peace and I don't want anybody to come and disturb my peace. So God is just confirming with his word. Because when you have a spam email, the best thing to do is to not open it. Because you may open it and it might contain a virus that could corrupt the files on your computer. And even worse, damage your hardware system to the point where you have to replace the computer completely. Another thing too, it might be a scam and if you click on any link inside of it, you might lose all of your life savings. So one of the best thing to do is to block and delete. Now as Christians, we tend to think that we always have to give people third, fourth and fifth chances. Not everybody deserve those opportunities. And forgiveness does not always mean reconciliation. You can forgive them, but you don't need to reconcile. Love them from a distance. And in today's society, so many things are going on right now. There's so many witchcraft because God was showing me like I could have opened up that email and it might have been a spell written in there where unknowingly I read it and I'm activating a spell over my life. So as Christians, we have to be smart. Prior is not good enough. We have to use wisdom because... We're living in a society where things are evolving. We have to evolve too. The wisdom of God surpasses all understanding. Some people are going to try to come back in your life. When they try to come back in your life, treat them like spam. Don't allow them to come back into your life and ruin your life. Especially when God is trying to elevate you, they will come back. Don't give them an opportunity. Treat them like spam.